and welcome back guys. We're going to be playing some more Dying Light 2 campaign today. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you support button. I've been really enjoying the gameplay so far. So let's go ahead and look at the map and see what we're doing. So we're going to be going over here to the boat. Get this quest turned in. Uh, I went ahead and got the power station on so we should have some more vents to kind of use the um, glider. Uh, try to get all the airdrops done as well. It's just a tedious process of going through and slowly doing all these. It takes a while. Uh, like, for instance, getting to this question mark. I don't know how the heck I'm going to get over there. Uh, look at all the chemicals. Like, this is all stuff that you can't walk through. Yikes. Anyways, let's get into playing some more Dying Light campaign. here already. The butchers are our greatest enemy. He's responsible for the Black Monday bombing and the death of two million people. Give you that same thing. This is all shit scratch. I'm jailed for my A 
above more proud core. Just have to be damn careful. Wheel Jack Matthews with these damn renegades. Don't want my name ending up in some of the street. Oh, it hurts like hell. You know they don't pay over to your back. There. All fixed. Shh. Keep it down. Sometimes the walls have ears. Do you know what this is, Aiden? Looks like, uh, uh pellets, buckshot. Oh. <laughs> Dios, que triste. These are eggs, Aiden. You have some really small chickens. Fish eggs. Beluga, to be exact. Straight from the Caspian Sea. Considered to be the only true caviar in the world. Dissolves on your tongue, letting you taste the waves of a black, deep sea in a faraway land. The world is full of beautiful things, beautiful sensations. Pretty boys and pretty girls. But humorless grunts don't notice that. They kill for the future and they forget the present. They? The major mats of the world. Please, join me. I've taken care of the UV lamps. Has Matt confided to you why he needs lamps in a place with no electricity yet? And how he's going to carry out this suicide mission? That's what I thought. Contact him. Tell him the lamps will be delivered to the TV station. Matt, the lamps are ready and waiting for you. Go there, Aiden. Good work. I hope Juan didn't give you any trouble. Juan said that the TV station has no power. What good are these lamps to us if we can't turn them on? Juan's just fucking around. Don't worry about that. Juan? Nah, he barks a little, but I can handle him. Good approach. Rabbit dogs must be kept at bay. And when they try to bite, put them out of their misery. Aiden, it's time we meet and talk about how to take that damn antenna. Wait for my signal. Roger. That. As you can see, Jack likes to give orders. Stay close to your radio. You'll be informed of the meeting shortly. Rabbit dogs. Good one. something to show you. I know about you. You help people. Well, I, I help people sometimes, yeah. I'll pay you, of course. I can't afford it. This is all mine. Mine and my dad's. Not in the market for a new skirt, but... You know what, sure. Tell me what you need. Okay. But this is just between you and me. Can't let dad find out. Oh, so it's his money you plan on spending. Nonsense. I'm trying to stop Dad's girlfriend from spending his money. Elena. She's got him wrapped around her finger. They've only been together a month and she's gone through his savings already. He's even mortgaged the shop. She has to be stopped, or we'll have nothing left. Take this. It's all I have. If this goes any further, she'll kill him. 
Wait, wait, what? Kill him? Like she did several so-called boyfriends before him. All fallen dead shortly after falling for her. Do you have proof? How about four bodies? All her exes except the last one. His name is Josh. Managed to escape her clutches alive. He can tell you all about her, I bet. Find Josh. Ask him. It may be the only way to save my father from his own stupidity. Where can I find Josh? Spends a lot of time at Frank's. Half in the bag. Usually after sunset. But I bet he can prove Elena is a killer. You're siding with the enemy, Pilgrim. Someday those chickens may just come to... She's still seeing that. Oh, yeah. Talk to me, son. I'm looking for a Josh, you know? I ain't a tourist info center. Scram! Excuse me, I am. Uh... Hey, mind your manners. Me and the lady are talking. Josh. For the love of God. If die, they people sleep. Good seeing you. Ader? Is that you? Hello, Pilgrim. This is my son. Oh, yeah, this is Aiden. I think we met when your dad was sick. Um, how's it going, Oya? Get lost. Oh, yeah. Sorry about that. He's having a hard time. A lot's changed for us. And what happened? You see, Patricia and I have separated. And once I've recovered, the first thing I wanted to do was get that motherfu- <sighs> Sorry, kid, cover your ears. You mean that motherfucking waltz? You've cursed like that a hundred times in front of me. Yeah, him. Uh, Patricia had asked me not to. But I wanted revenge on waltz for killing my men, for killing Lucas. And him escaping punishment, you know? Well, did you get him? Nah. A few days after I was walking again, I started looking for him. And Patricia pleaded with me, but... When I returned home after a few days, I found it empty. Patricia had moved out and taken the boys with her. Most of their things were gone. All I found was a letter. Just a few words, really. <laughs> Apparently, while I was stationed in old Villador, Patricia had made contact with her ex-husband. I've no idea what she saw in a stuffy old teacher. He's only our teacher. Jeez, Dad. Oh, yeah. Look, I know you're only trying to protect your mother. Although, to be fair, 
They aren't living together. I don't know what's going on. Mum left because she was tired of it all. She'd had enough. Yeah, that's true. More than enough, I suppose. Uncertainty, fear for me. Wondering whether I'd come back alive. But now I've only got one goal. To get my family back. I know how you feel. Sometimes, in our rush toward our goals, we forget about the people around us. You've been running around, looking for someone this whole time, haven't you? Yes, my sister. Waltz may know something about her. I hope you don't lose yourself. Like I have. Patricia won't talk to me. Or yeah, well, you can see for yourself. Only my youngest gives me the time of day. I'm teaching him how to handle weapons. But being with them makes me stronger. I won't take any more of your time. I wish you the best, Dater. Wait. Remember Lazarus? It's a solid weapon. And it's unlikely to be of any use to me anymore. I was supposed to kill Waltz with it. You do it for me. You can bet I will. Bye, Oyer. Get lost. I can't believe I'm going to see the electricity. Turn. Does your mother ever talk about me? Did she left a coat behind and you were supposed to bring it? Oh, damn it, I forgot. Fine. Fine, I'll go get it. Bring a video's building blocks too, because he can take him more. How you doing, buddy? Oh, anything else I can do for you? Excuse me, I am. Uh... Hey, mind your manners. Me and the lady are talking. Aiden, you've been around. Hey, a while. stop staring at me. Practically one of us now. Frank is one handsome fella. It's a shame he's such a booze hound. for a Josh, you know? I ain't a tourist info center. Scram! I think this is all a test from God. Well, I'm a pass his test. Please hey, back off. You got a problem? Chatter about the night runners rising from the ashes lately. People need hope. Just because you got holes in your shoes doesn't mean you're poor. If you got one to lean on. So guys, I'm gonna go find Josh. This may take me a little while, because I don't know if it's a specific time I've gotta be here. I don't know if I need to be here at nighttime. So this might take a couple minutes to figure out. Anyways, make sure you hit that like button, make sure you support button. I know this video wasn't very eventful. I thought it would be, but, well, this is, we're both finding out things as we go. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm just gonna kinda uh, mess around and Try to find this Josh character. Anyways, I'll see you again soon. But the merchant's late. Sorry to hear that.